Well, let's take a look at what was going on on social media today. And we've talked a lot about Venus and Serena pulling out of the U.S. Open. That was not the only announcement of someone pulling out today. Sophia Kennan, the 2020 Australian Open champion, announcing later in the day that she has tested positive for COVID-19. Despite being vaccinated, by the way, a breakthrough case, she's decided that she's not going to be able to get to the U.S. Open. So a disappointment for Kennan, who had that amazing 2020 20, winning the Aussie Open, finalist at Roland Garros, but Nico, we will not see her in New York. Well, she has been struggling with her tennis, but this is something much more serious, and may this serve as an example for everybody, not only tennis players, to be aware and to use common sense and just to be ready because she was vaccinated and she tested positive, as has a lot of people, so please, everybody, let's do our part with this, this thing that has just been harassing us for the last couple of years. All right, well, on a much lighter note, and I love this, Riley Opelka talking about players coming to New York and going to Chipotle, making the, the dining decisions that they make. And, John, as a New Yorker, I find it outrageous that a player would come and go to one of these places. <laughs> Far be it for me to disparage Chipotle. They are creatures of habit, these tennis players are. And, uh, <laughs> you know, we, we've got Cheesecake Factory, Chipotle, very, very popular on the road. But, yeah, you can do uh, flat fixes. Give them a shout-out at Union Square. You can do a lot better Mexican food than Chipotle. Uh, Taylor Fritz, do the right thing, buddy. Well, listen, Riley is only 23. He, he has time. I like his artistic take. You know, I like where, where he's going. He, he has time to learn. All right, well, here's Arena Sabalenka practicing her serve. And this is an interesting way to practice it. She's basically using her coach for target practice. <laughs> and that is something a lot of people do. You just have to be there. And Sabalenka went all at it. She didn't take anything off that serve. So that coach is pretty trusting. It's just a good thing she doesn't hit that hard. It's a good <laughs> thing she doesn't have a lot of power. That guy can... Oh, wait a second. Um, yeah, we saw... Roger Federer and uh, Gael Monfils <laughs> a few months ago. This is uh, potentially uh, a repeat of that. All right. Well, hey, if it works, it works.